Well, today we're gonna see how many cows we can work in a single day with two people and they're scattered between three places. So, Kylie went to work. I'm here waiting on her dad so I can go catch cows. So, uh, let's take a look at what we're gonna do. So I just got back home and I want to demonstrate just how so special, special I say, some people are. So we have a box, cause we have a gate. Really? You pick the rock up, put it on the package. Oh look, another package on top of the package box. Sun's bright. It's in your face. I said over here, it's in my face. It's not green. What is it? <clears throat> uh, shower gift. Ooh. Brown, black, cow skin, B, dot, 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 R, S, newborn shower gift. I'm going to have to open it. I don't know what it is. You can open it inside. Open it. Where it's clean. Is there anything in the inside there? 
Um, see. What does it say on there? Julie Fancher. Julie. Can you say what it is? <clears throat> oh, it is a baby car seat canopy cover, multi-use oh. nursing cover for newborn car seat canopy mom. I got the idea. I remember. Feet. It's a car seat cover that is universal for other things. Thank you, Julie. See, Amazon's killing two trees. <sighs> and they could have killed just one. See, it's just cow print. Looks Thank like, you, Julie. It looks like um, Dolly. I don't see Dolly. If you don't mind oh, getting a hold of no. us, I'll show you the babies that are up this morning. If you don't mind getting a hold of us on our Facebook page, Lone Rock Longhorns will send you a uh, thank you note. Look at this little cutie this morning. And they're all up here. Everyone thinks they're hungry. It's breakfast time. Well, anyways, Aaron, do you want to tell them what you were doing today? Picking up the cows I bought. Hey, oh, that's lovely. Anyways, we have to work several pastures today. Ugh. So, I am a designated uh, picture taker. Thought you were going shopping. Or a video taker. While they work. It's going to be a disaster. I don't know if you guys can see this. Probably not. That little baby has her head stuck between two trees itching. And we'll see if she's smart enough to figure out how to get back out. Like she got in there. Anyways. we. Uh, Anyways, we're going to go work cows. Have to work some cows, After. so... <laughs> Stay tuned. He's cranky, you guys, so we'll hope he doesn't say much to you. They say working cows with their significant other either helps or gets a divorce. I don't know which one. Whose cows are these? pain in my butt. Whose cows are these? I have you know the problem cows are your father's. Yeah. That's one of the problem cows. She got herself caught though. So in the video right before this, you guys saw Aaron's dad and my dad, they were helping us get some trees cut out of this working tin. Nice trash can. Are you angry? He 
Yeah, you're angry. I'm glad I wasn't standing much closer. I can pet you. You can't do nothing. So this is a wormer. The other two shots he gave him are, I'm assuming, black leg and, what was the other one? I can't give him that one without a needle. What's this one you're giving him over here? What'd you just give him? You're giving him two doses of the one? I want to give him two sixes and a half or one twelve? Two sixes and a half. I assume it's ten per side. Yeah, it's ten per side. Yeah, I'm going to give him two doses of the Don't sound very good over there. No, no, no. to stick a hand in this one. Frank checker. She's the only one in this pasture that hasn't had a baby yet. She's one of our registered red Angus, so we really need a baby. There should be a baby right there. Rodney sticks his hand in. Okay, she's fighting. There you go. So if this bothers anybody, fast forward.
you think, Vic? Mm -hmm. Feel the baby's head. Something. That's good. Hurts her lucky day. <laughs> trying to decide if it's trying to bite me or kick me. <laughs> well, as long as you feel it, we're good. Mm -hmm. I need to hurry up and have that baby, Mama. Mm -hmm. You need to have a baby. You need to have your baby. They worked all the cows. Now Aaron gets to uh, band these little guys. Well, oh, they're not that big, are they? What? Bull calf. What I threaten Aaron with all the time. Are we lifting? It's so good, Mom. Yeah. Mama, she looks just like you. Oh, you did good, Diva.
twirling myself on the plate. <laughs> What they said. Stop! It's hard as a rock, though. It's better, though. Is it hard as a rock, or is it better? Well, I mean... It's better than when we started. It's huge. It's I mean, it's, it's, so, we got the new cows that we bought last Sunday. We picked them up yesterday. And... Well, they're from the neighbor, which is next to one of our places, so they know what our food truck looks like. They might not like our cows and have to hang out with them, but they sure know which truck to follow when it pulls in. It appears I was off on my preg checks yesterday because I said she was probably gonna calve in like two days. Uh, well. It was definitely like hours after we left yesterday. So I was right, she was pregnant, but I was off on the time. And get your food, right there, get your food. Yeah, you know better. Well, here at the wheat field, grab a barrel of hay for the calves. Gonna check the wheat, check the oats, grab a bell for the cows, go feed them, come back and get a wheat bell to take home for the longhorns. Yeah, that's about it. So we took 14 calves home that are going to go to the sale barn tomorrow, you know, pay some bills. Uh, took Tater home to be with the rest of the Longhorns. He was getting a little big to be in a remote place. Um, so yeah, it's kind of strange feeding 27 and instead of 42, but uh, they're definitely showing all the bunk space. What are you doing? Here, I gotta pet Waylon. Let me pet you. Let me pet you. I got him. She's down here eating on the end. I bet I can't pet her. Oh, you gonna let me pet you? Oh, look at you. So, nope, the ones from the house will come out here. Some of them will come out here this week. Actually, most of them will come out here this week. My granddad's buying three of the heifers, but other than that, everybody else will come out here, hang out with these guys, get the good grass that's not here, not growing, because it still hasn't rained. But 
Well, most of these are all the heifers that we're going to breed this year and hopefully have about, uh, you know, hopefully over 60% of them breed and we'll have some uh, bred heifers for next year. Still don't know if it's cheaper than buying more. Very difficult to figure out whether. What are you looking at? That's what I thought. No. Hard to figure out if it's uh, cheaper to raise a heifer to be a cow or if it's cheaper to go buy a cow. But this one has a white face so she can hang around. Yeah, that's what I thought. Off to the next. We just gotta get a little creative. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. It just needs a little, you watch yourself. Get a little push towards the edge of the hill. And even to move out of the way. See how easy that was? Much easier with the tractor. Do you know that if a cow tries hard enough to hide her baby or baby wants to hide bad enough, they'll kick into camouflage mode. She's walking over there trying to hide the fact that I know her baby does not look like a tree. Good try, Mama. Good try. But I definitely found her. So a game of hide and seek and I win.